Hey guys, it's Brandy. So I am back with another grocery haul. We didn't need a ton of stuff this week, so it's a pretty small grocery haul, but um, I picked up a couple interesting things. So let me hop into it and show you guys what I got. The first thing I got this week was this Deer Park sparkling water. Um, the people at Deer Park actually sent me a coupon for a free um, eight pack of the 12 ounce cans. They had several flavors. They had a pomegranate, lemonade, an orange. They had a lime and maybe a black cherry. I can't remember. Um, but I picked up the orange. That one sounded the most appealing to me. Um, I really like orange stuff or orange flavored drinks. So I picked up the orange. Those are zero points and I'm really excited to try those. The next thing that I picked up is some 99% fat free ground turkey breast. It's extra lean. It is zero points for four ounces, which I mean, it's zero points for six ounces, whatever. Um, so I grabbed that today. I'm gonna do some burgers. We're gonna do some burgers on the grill tonight. I thought I had some frozen turkey patties in the freezer, but I did not. So grabbed that for some turkey burgers. Of course, I always grab eggs. We use eggs all the time. So I grabbed those. The next thing I have here is this um, crumbled, I am not even gonna pretend to pronounce this. Um, this is the cheese that I use in my street corn. A lot of people have asked me what this cheese is. So this is the one that I get. I find it at Kroger, it's the Kroger brand. Um, I get the part skim milk variety and it's two teaspoons. You can have two teaspoons for one point and again, this is the cheese that I use in my street corn. I'm going to make that on Sunday, and I will try to film that. That's been a popular recipe. A lot of people on Instagram have asked me for that recipe. So I will be um, filming that for you guys on Sunday. The next thing I've got is the Sargento. Oops, sorry about that. This Sargento, Sargento Ultra Thin Swiss Cheese. Um, this stuff, you can have one slice for one point or two slices for three points. And I'm going to make a recipe from Drizzle Me Skinny. She has a Monte Cristo bake using this cheese. And I also it also uses some ham. So I picked up this Oscar Mayer ham. It's three slices for one point. Um, and then you also use reduced fat crescent rolls and some eggs. So I'm going to make that for breakfast this week. So I picked that up. I also picked up just one potato. Um... Again, like I said, we are having burgers tonight. I'm gonna fix my carrot fries um, for my burgers, but my husband is wanting some wedges, so I just picked up one potato for him. And I also picked up some real bacon bits. Um, I like to put these on salads or sometimes in scrambled eggs. You can have one tablespoon for one point. And then I always grab this. I always get a bag of this just about every single week. This is the fat-free shredded cheddar cheese from Kraft. You can have a quarter cup for zero points. So it's actually pretty good. The fat-free cheeses of, of days past wouldn't melt and were kind of gummy. But I actually really like this cheese. The next thing that I picked up, this was also free today, this week or today. Um, this was on my Kroger app. I had... I guess the free Friday um, download for the week was a Quest Bar. So I picked up this chocolate peanut butter just because this is a flavor I haven't ever tried before. And this one is only four points. So I'm excited to try that. The next thing that I got this week were these Keebler um, Club Crackers. And again, this showed up. I got these for free as well. Um, these were a customer best bonus or something. I'm not really sure. But again, it was on my Kroger card. So I picked up the reduced fat version. You can have five crackers for two points. So that's not too bad. I'll stick those in the pantry for salads and stuff like chicken salad. Um, I needed some more spray. I can't believe it's not butter. We have been eating corn from the garden like crazy. And I like to spray this stuff on my corn. It's zero points, so, um, you know, I can't, I can't pass up the flavor. The next thing that I grabbed was this um, fully cooked microwave bacon. We grab, we do this sometimes for breakfast, just, just for quick, a quick little something, maybe with some scrambled eggs and some toast or something. 
You can have three slices of this for two points. So that's that's not too, too bad. Let's see, what else? Oh, the next thing that I got here was just some ranch um, seasoning, the, the dip mix. I like to add this to my burgers. Again, I'm having turkey burgers tonight, so I'll mix this in for some seasoning. The entire package, which is 28 grams, is two points. Um, 14 grams of the package is one point, and you can have up to five grams for zero points. So once I weigh out my burger and add this to it, I'll be able to figure out how many points worth of seasoning that I am adding to my burgers. The next thing that I grabbed, now this stuff is not WW friendly, um, which I mean, it's not off, it's not off limits because nothing is off limits. We can have anything, but um, my mom's birthday is on Sunday and she asked for a devil's food chocolate cake with cream cheese frosting. So my family's coming over on Saturday, tomorrow night, for a birthday celebration for my mom. So I'm gonna make that cake for her and I probably will have a small slice of it, but the rest of that is gonna go home with her. So I'm not even gonna tell you guys how many points those are because they're astronomical. The next thing that I grabbed were these um, light and fit Greek yogurts. If you've been with me for any time on Instagram or here on YouTube, you know I eat a non-fat Greek yogurt every morning for breakfast. I did not need Greek yogurt this week, but these were all on sale for 45 cents. So only the vanilla and the strawberry versions were on sale. Um, so I really couldn't pass those up. I picked up, let's see, I think I got four of each. Um, so like I said, for 45 cents, I just really couldn't pass that up. The next thing that I got were some carrot sticks. These are the sticks that I use to make my carrot fries with. And, um, I mean, I could just buy regular carrots, but let's be honest, I'm lazy. So, these are not that more, much more expensive than, than regular carrots anyway. So, this is what I'm going to use to make my carrot fries with tonight. And the last thing that I bought were, was this English cucumber. Um, they're seedless. They don't have as many seeds in them. I'm just going to do some simple salads this week. And I thought cucumber sounded really, really good on my salad. And then, so that's the end of my grocery that I purchased. So let me show you this. We ended up going by the, my husband's uncle's farm after we went to the grocery store and he sent us home with all of this fresh corn. So I will be taking all of the silks and stuff off of this and bagging some of it up to freeze. I'll be cutting some of it off of the cob to make my street corn with and we'll just be eating corn for the next foreseeable future. <laughs> so that's this week's grocery haul, guys. I hope you liked it. Um, if you did, I would appreciate you giving me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. YouTube should notify you every time I upload something new. Have a good week, guys.